the escapement used in the quadecimus is a deadbeat, so called because of its dead faces or, more commonly, locking faces. Here you can see the escapement in its locked or dead phase. During this phase, the escapement wheel does not move at all. However, the weight of the pendulum keeps the anchor in motion. As the pendulum continues its swing, the escapement wheel tooth slips from the locking face to the impulse face. The impulse face is slightly slanted, so that when the escapement wheel tooth pushes against it, it impulses the pendulum. The escapement wheel tooth then slips off the impulse face, allowing the escapement wheel to turn freely, until it hits the opposite locking face. This is also where the typical ticking sound is produced. Here you can see the escapement in action. Notice how the amount the anchor dips into the escapement wheel is for both sides pretty equal. It is vital for the accuracy of the clock that the escapement has a locking phase. If this is not the case, the clock will never be accurate and will be prone to stopping.